Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm doing another mod review. And the mods I will be doing is the Macaw mods. Like Macaw bridges, windows, roofs, doors, and paths, and paintings, trap doors, furniture, fence walls, light lamps, and doors. I think I already said doors, but yeah, that's what we're- Hello everybody, uh, today I'll be reviewing the Macaw mods as you saw in the beginning. And there's a lot to cover, because it is a lot- oh, my turning. Uh, it is a lot of mods. So, we'll just start out with Macaw's Bridges. As you can see, there's plenty of different types. I'm not sure the crafting recipes, I didn't really look much. But, there is a whole bunch of bridges you can do. I'll just use, uh, here we go. As you can see, there's that. You can just, there's also diff a lot of different types of bridges. There's also stairs. If you want to, you know, mix it up, you can. Let's get a piece of stone. And we'll just patch that up. And then, actually, I'm pretty sure I need this. Uh, and I'm pretty sure you, you can just walk right there. Unless. No, I'm pretty sure it's that way. But anyway, it's a bridge. Uh, on this one, I'm gonna about to show you can do basically the same thing, except it's slightly different. So I'll just expand this bridge out. And then, uh, as you see, I have bridge supports. Like, if you want to add some extra detail to your bridges, you can put these in if you want. Just go ahead and... And then, there you go. Got some extra detail to your bridge. I'm not sure, let me check. Okay, so you cannot combine bridges unless they're the same type. Like, I placed an iron bridge, I can't connect the bamboo, but I can connect more iron. We can just you can do all that crap. So uh that's basically the bridges for you. Unless I miss something, which I don't think I did. Nope. Okay. So we'll just now we're gonna do the windows. Window base. I'm not sure what these do. I have used this mod before, I just don't know everything. Because you can see there's this stuff and there's different types of styled windows which would be good like this kind of style would be good in like a church or something. Or some kind of building. Anyway. And you can see through. And then, there's that. Okay, you cannot put the windows on that. So, as you can see, there's that shine, so it is a window. 
and then there's the oak window, and with these type of windows, you can just open them, which is kind of cool. Uh, let me test something. Can you shoot through arrows through them when they're open? Well, that would. Yes, you can. That is cool. So, that also applies with all of the other windows. Because, you know, they're the same. I mean, you can't shoot through, like, these windows. I'm not sure why the particles aren't showing up. But, so that's the windows. And then there's some panes as well. I'm sure there's more at the bottom, yeah. And we'll go on to Macaw's Windows Editions. Which is basically just an add-on to the windows. And then we got like a windowsill. More uh, windows and some blinds. Which the blinds, as we can see, block the windows. And then there's that. So this would be really good for like walls if you have like a fortress per se. You can just go right through. And then there's if I can get rid of it. A windowsill. And then I can just use this. So that's the Windows Edition. I'll just clear my inventory real quick. And then we got roofs. And then uh, the oak cube roof. This doesn't really do much. It's basically just the wood block, but. It has these two little things attached to it. And then, got this, we got skylights. We got top roof, we got lower, steep. So there's all sorts of variation to the roofs. I'll just... Wait. Okay, there we go. And then we got... So yeah, there's a lot of variation with the windows. There's all sorts of wood and terracotta and I'm pretty sure concrete. Yeah. And then there's bricks. There's different types of stones, and then they got the mud bricks as well, and also deep slate, which is cool. Because we're also doing this in 1.19, so kind of makes sense to add those. And moving on to awnings and gutters. Uh, so here we got the uh, awning, and then we got gutters, and then drop parts and let's just get a block oh my gosh such a headache today okay so as you can see the awning it's an awning Oops. can you expand them no but it is an awning like if you have a shop that would definitely be a good addition to your shop and we got rain gutters. And... I'm not sure... How you connect these. Unless you just, like, can't. So, yeah. Um... Turn it day real quick. Starting to go down. 
There we go. So, moving on to doors. We got a bunch of door prints, and then we got all these different styles in every type of wood. And then we got this type. We got, like, birch. So, like, if you like the window of birch uh, doors, but you don't want to, like, uh, but you don't like it just being birch, you don't like it being oak. Like, see, like, you don't like it being that bright, you can use that. And there's, we got this one, which is a sliding door, which is, I think is pretty cool. It is kind of annoying to put back in place. You just have to hit the bottom. And we got this one. So this is basically just the spruce door. But you can put it with any wood type. And then we got this. It's got... It's pretty self-explanatory. Barn door. And we got a door with glass. Like, say, like, you don't like the regular... Uh, oak door how the windows are like you can barely see anything through it right like oh this gives you so much more vision and that's I'm pretty sure it on the door mod yes there's also metal doors and yeah there's a whole bunch of different doors I'll let you check that out and then we got Path and pavings. Here we got like wood paths. So, like, if you want a nice path going up to your yard at your house or something, you got a nice little path. Just a quick theory can you put. Okay, you cannot. I was gonna test if you could put the this on the bridges. Site diamond paving. Well that doesn't look bad, that looks pretty cool. And then yeah, there's like whole different shapes, like there's in a site basket weave. There's square paving, which I accidentally got rid of. Uh, honeycomb pavings, clover paving, and whatever this is, dumble paving. Like, I used to have this type of bricks in my back, old backyard at my old house. And, uh, there's this, and, oh, this is actually pretty nice. And also, uh, I'm pretty sure you could probably also, you also probably know what you can use this for. Just, um. Eat. Okay, so anyway. Uh, we also got the clover, which isn't much different from the honeycomb, it's just, there's more space. Then we got this, which actually doesn't look bad, this looks pretty good. And then we got trapdoors next. Barn trapdoor, swamp, oh yeah, swamp trapdoor, like, this is the mangrove trapdoor, but Maybe you don't like it being in red. Maybe you want it in oak. Like with all the other things. Like basically what the doors and trapdoors mod does. It's basically make it so that you can get any style of Basically, you can get any type of style you want in any material. Like this I could use for like crates, like if I get, uh, I'll 
say it later. And then next we got fences and walls. So we got wired fences, which is like, so if you have, like, you're trying to do a war, like RP or something or video, uh, you can do that with this. It's basically just barbed wire. As you can see, I can't go over it, which I bet if I go on survival mode. Yeah, that hurts. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, and then we got the oak fence, which I'm glad it's like, it shows the post first, because I've seen some mods where it just shows this entire fence in one block, and it's kind of chaotic, like, it, now it just shows the post, like, if you just want it like that, like, if I get a, uh, that's not how you spell it, <laughs> flower pot, and then you get Uh, cornflower, per se, I guess. Uh, and then we can... Boop. Boom. Kind of little decoration. And we also got, like, stone-style wall. Which some homes have. And then we got, like, graveyard-style. Oh, you can open them. Oh, this is a gate. Okay. Let me get... I'll just get stone brick wall. You can go like this. And then boom. And if you wanted, all this looks like a really good material for jail cells. And that's the entire mod. Uh, not mod, but that mod anyway. And then we got furniture. Which is our last mod we're showing today. Wardrobe we have. So we can probably store stuff in here. I'm assuming. Yeah. You can just put that straight in there. And we got modern wardrobe. We got double wardrobe. Bookshelf. Cupboard. Bookshelf. Drawer. We got double drawer, and then there's a whole bunch of other stuff, which I'm probably not going to color cover all of them today, but maybe in another video, uh, once I know more about the mods. So, we got modern wardrobe. Okay, I think after my OBS crashing, uh, I think we can continue. To, uh, onto the last mod. Uh, what just killed a pig? Oh, the barbed wire. Okay, so, last mod. The lighting and lamps. So, as you can see, we got all these lamps. It has like a kind of like a wool cover. Yeah, that's wool. Okay. Uh, and then we got tiki torches. That's cool. You probably need to. Oh. Oh. I was thinking you would have to, like. Uh. Light them up with a. Flint and steel. You can also. If you want to, you can stand on top of it and boop. And it gets taller. And turn it on and off. And we got ceiling light. So I'm kind of ceiling, so I'll just do that. And that lights it up pretty good. And then, uh, last light we got is street lamp post, double street lamp, soul street lamp, double soul street lamp, lava lamp, and lastly but not least, garden light. Okay, maybe least. 
Oh, yeah, if you have a big yard, like a big mansion you've built, this would definitely be a good addition to add to, like, your driveway. Oh, we got the lava lamp. Thank God it's in a lamp. It's not... Let's see, will it hurt you? Oh, it doesn't hurt you. I would have thought it would have hurt you. Okay, and then we got the street lamp. Which you can turn it on and off. Oh my goodness. Which... If I can get on here. There we go. And crouch, jump. Uh... Hold on, technical difficulties. There we go. Make it taller. Surprisingly, the tiki torch is taller. And then there is double lamp. What did I just do? Okay. Boom. And then we got the same thing, but with with uh, soul lamps. And they're animated, which is, uh, that's cool. So yeah, that's all the, uh, mods for our, all of Macaw's mods he's made. Or she. So, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, and hope you consider trying out some of these mods. And see you next time.